Welcome to the candy shop. Coming in at number five, guys, is the ingot. It just, just look at it, guys. It looks absolutely horrific. I put them in the worst colours possible as well, just to make them look even worse. But just, it's really bad at turning. It's front wheel drive, and <laughs> it's not even the worst. So that's why it's so high on this list. So yeah, it's just awful I don't recommend getting this it's a waste of your nine grand you could spend it on friggin your mechanic or something but anyway let's just move on to number four Coming in at number 4 guys is the Toyota Prius or in GT5 the Dilettante and just like the other one it's just horrific to look at it just looks like a massive turd and all my cars are in pink or yellow like I said before but this is also front wheel drive but I think this is even worse at turning guys and it, it couldn't even burn out then uh, because we tried to get it to burn out but it didn't and it's just it's just horrifying to look at and it's 40k I think and that is not worth it let's just move on to number three guys because I don't want to speak about this one anymore Coming in at number three, guys, is um, the slowest vehicle in this bloody list. It's so goddamn slow. And who the hell wants to be seen riding around Los Santos on this horrible piece of shit? It's just terrifying to look at. Everyone's just going to laugh at you if you come around the corner on it. You're trying to look all cool on it? Well, you're not. And also... This vehicle is like, I think it's 16k, and none of these vehicles are worth the money that you've got to spend on them. And even worse is you can freaking fall off it, which is even more embarrassing. And the freaking leopard seats make it even worse. And there's no customizations for it, and it's bad at turning as well for a freaking scooter. And yeah, it couldn't even keep up with that ingot right there. But anyway. Let's move on to number two. Okay guys, coming in at number two is the Dundry Regina and oh my god it's just so bad. This would have come at number one but there is a vehicle even more terrifying than this but let's just speak about this. It's bad at turning, it's ugly as hell, it's too much money for it and what the hell are those bags on the top? So, I don't even want to look in any longer, let's go to number one. So guys, the worst vehicle 
on GTA 5 is the journey and just looking at it makes you want to freaking get a gun towards your head and shoot it you'd rather freaking eat your own poo than drive this it's just so bad it can't even freaking drive properly and it looks like God just shat out of his arse and that's your vehicle that you have to own and yeah let's just say this is the top five worst vehicles guys and peace out